We're 90 days away from the start of the U.S. Senior Open, which will likely draw thousands of golf fans to central Wisconsin. NBC's Golf Channel will be broadcasting this spectacle on national television, and the people covering the tournament are already preparing. Newswatch tells Matt Weaver joins us with more. Matt? Shh. Jerry Kelly for par to take home the title. And the title's his to claim. The 2023 U.S. Senior Open will have golf broadcaster Mark Rolfing on the call. He took in the sights and sounds of Central World before he takes his seat in the Lookout Tower this summer. Stricker for birdie at 17. Give it to him. Golf Channel announcer Mark Rolfing will call the U.S. Senior Open, the largest event that Stevens Point has ever seen. Now this is going to be the biggest sporting event ever in central Wisconsin. There's no doubt in my mind. And I think the great thing about it is going to be just how excited the people are to see this level of golf here. As for the Central World course itself, he believes it will play tough. I think it's going to be a really good test. Um, Driving length is not going to be as important as driving accuracy. And although the course wasn't quite ready for play, Rolfing says his visit earlier this week was perfect timing. I wanted to look at corridors as much as anything. Sometimes we get so caught up in taking a look at the actual hole itself um, that, that I tend to lose track of of what the overall experience is like. And it's almost better for me to first look at it uh, when there's snow on the ground because I can't see pin placements. There aren't any. I can't see where the tees are. By scouting out the landscape, he can see dog legs, bunkers, and the length of each hole, all to better prepare himself for when he's in the broadcast tower this June. I'm really seeing some tremendous balance in the holes. And, you know, people have asked me over the last kind of 12 hours what are my favorite holes out there and i've changed my mind every time so that's good wintry weather may seem imminent but the spring thaw isn't far off it was a perfect time for me to come and once the grass starts growing and the flowers come out at 16 then i'll be back in stevens point matt weaver news watch 12